Decorating Fanatic here. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Now today I'm super excited because I get to pick a winner today at five o'clock for my bath or my office sign. Now all you have to do is watch my video and if you leave me a comment and if you're new to my channel, subscribe and then I will pick a winner at five o'clock. So now in front of me, I have some DIY Christmas projects that I'm gonna do. I have some bows that I made and I will be showing you how to make them. I have my picture frames, I have some bulbs, I have some ribbon and some greenery. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys, I'm ready to get started. Now for this project, I have this one frame that I got at a yard sale. Now it's perfect for Christmas because it's gold and it has green on it. So I think it's the perfect colors. And then I have my green bulb that we'll be using and two red bulbs. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hang the green bulb down here and then my two red bulbs will be higher up and then I have this ribbon we'll be using, and now this is the perfect size for it to fit in the bulb, for it to hang. Now all I'm doing now is waiting for my hot glue to uh, get ready, and then I'll, in the meantime, I'll be uh, cutting my string for the different lengths. So I went ahead and got my ribbon all cut and glued. Now you want your bulb to hang just above the bottom of your frame. Now to get the two bulbs to line up equally, you wanna make sure that you cut your string exactly the same size length and those will line up perfectly. So let's go ahead and add our two bulbs. Okay guys, I finished attaching my bulbs and I think they came out pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and attach some greenery and we're gonna use maybe, I think I might put a little berries in there and then I will come back and I'm gonna show you how to make a bow. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to make a bow. Now what I'm gonna do is um, on the ends here, you're gonna go ahead and put some hot glue on each end and then you're going to fold it over like this and then you'll get that to stick and you'll do it on both sides so let me go ahead and put some glue on there and fold those over now like I've said before you want to be real careful with the hot glue because that stuff gets on your fingers and that can burn so get in here so you guys can see and then just fold it over throw some hot glue under there and then press down and then all you need to do is gather it in the middle and then you just fan out the little sides of your bow and then let's see make them even on both sides Okay, so now what you wanna do is where I have it gathered, you wanna stick a little bit of glue in there to hold it and just pinch it together. And of course this can be, it's not really hard, but sometimes you can get glue on your fingers and your fingers will stick. But anyways, and there you have the bow. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cut a little berry off and put that in the middle. Now I'm going to just put a little bit of glue on the top here and then we're going to add the little berry. I think this one's like a rose gold. This is real pretty. And then you just stick it right there and there you have it. You have a bow. So that's going to go on my frame and what I'm going to do next is put my greenery on and then add the bow. I got my hot glue and I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to attach the greenery right here to the corner. Now, if you think you might want yours in the middle, you, you could do that also, but I'm gonna put mine on the corner because I think that looks cute there on the corner. And I'm just gonna hold that for a few minutes to make sure it sticks. Hold that for a few more minutes. And then now I'm gonna attach my bow. Let's take a look and see what it looks like. Of course, my dog's barking. And there you have it. Here's the finished project, and I made this cute little bow with the berry. Then I have my greenery, 
And of course, I picked up this frame from a yard sale, and then I had some leftover bulbs, and then I'm using this ribbon to attach the bulbs to hang it, and I think this is really a cute idea. Now, of course, you could use any colored bow or berry that you'd want. And I think the frame works perfect for Christmas. It's green and gold, and I'm using the green bulb. Now, of course, any colored bulbs or a frame would work. And then I made this one last night with a different bow and a red berry. So I hope this inspires you to get crafty. And, of course, these would make a great gift for your neighbor or anyone else. And until next time, happy decorating!